morning guys welcome to another vlog it is tuesday today the day after the public holiday and i'm back at school four days this week which is good a shorter week but it's still gonna be very busy i have gotten ready a little bit earlier this morning because we have a meeting before school which is really interesting it's like a behavioral meeting so i'm very excited to sit in on that um but i want to get there a little bit earlier because i don't want to get into the room late <laughs> that's like one of my fears is walking into a meeting late like just mm. look at how shiny my hair is looking look at that oh my god yeah today is an assessment day at school so a little bit less teaching but it'll be really interesting to see how things go from an assessment point of view because I've never seen that so that'll be good and then I am teaching the last session of the day which is their health so that's kind of the agenda for today and then I've got a staff meeting after school so today will be a big day I feel like I'm a lot more prepared this week than I have been the past couple of weeks so that always feels good I am going to go and do my journaling and then make breakfast to go and head into school but I thought I'd show you my outfit before I go it's quite cool today so I've got a sweater on this is from Petal and Pop my pants are from the iconic this is the fit yeah as I said it's quite cool today I've got my veyers on it's hard because I'm dressing for the weather but our classroom is quite warm sometimes so this could be a really silly outfit to wear could be warm all day and be thanking myself it could go one or two ways i'm going to get ready for school and i'll talk to you soon hello guys it's been a very long day <laughs> i had a lot of meetings like i said at school today my lessons went well which was good had a few wins which is great um i feel a lot more like calm and confident in front of the kids which is great and it something that just obviously comes with practice yeah i feel like i've built really good relationships with all the kids which is awesome um so yeah i got stuck in so much traffic on the way home which was not a vibe and then spent like an hour and a half lesson planning and doing schoolwork. i just had some dinner and now i'm gonna relax for the rest of the night and i'm so excited like my days just feel so long it's seven o'clock like it's like a massive 12 hour day but anyway I made an order a week or two ago on Chemist Warehouse because I needed a few things and it's just saves me time. I can't be bothered going in there. Thought I'd give you a little haul. I got one of my favorite cleansers. This is like my go-to nighttime cleanser and then I use the Bohemian Skin cleanser in the morning um, but I like this one. Um, it's the SA Smoothing Cleanser. It's really good if you've got bumpy skin which is a whole other situation I'm still dealing with, like my acne and dermatitis on my face. It's just, I emailed my skin therapist because I'm just starting to get to the point where I'm actually self-conscious about my skin. And even though it doesn't look bad, like I totally understand, I don't have deep cystic pimples anymore. It's like the texture of my skin is still visible. So it kind of looks worse than I guess it is. This is my go-to cleanser, moral of the story. Some razors, lip balm. I've never actually tried this, but it sounded gorge. This is my deodorant, if you were wondering. I also got a new night cream, the CeraVe Skin Renewing Night Cream. Um, I'm almost out of my Cetaphil one, and I don't not like it, but I just thought I'd try something else, and I really like CeraVe skincare. I also got one of these Emco Beauty, um, like, cases for your beauty blender there's a beauty blender in here too which i needed a new one of but i thought especially when i go traveling it's good to like separate my sponge from the rest of my makeup bag my go-to mascara the cover girl supersizer you can't do wrong i know i could buy higher end mascaras but like don't fix so it's not broken it's so good also got this to try and i'm very excited about it it's the emco beauty flawless glow it looks just like the charlotte tilbury i just guessed the shade so i don't know we might be a bit off but it's gorge and i'm very excited to try it saint tropez self tan 
drops. I'm running out of my Bondi Sands one, so I just thought we'd give it a go. I like adding this even when I'm pale. I feel like just adding a little bit of self tan drops to my moisturizer just helps my face look less ghostly and makes me feel a little bit more confident when I'm not fake tanned. Um, so yeah, just a bit of a confidence tip I'm trying to get better at, but yeah, we'll see how this goes. But yeah, I'm going to have a shower, get my school clothes off, PJs, unwind, and watch a bit of Farmer Once a Wife because I'm all prepped and ready for tomorrow. So now I can relax. Good morning, it is Thursday. I am running a teensy bit late, but this is my outfit today. All centered around matching my earrings. I have so many cute earrings that I forgot about. And I now need to find outfits that go with them. This is my outfit for today. The green pants that I've been wearing, black top. It's very simple. And this cardigan, uh, I should wear a blazer. I don't know how I feel about that. Like it looks a bit too much. I don't know. And it gets warm later in the day. I also, at my school, a lot of the staff are way sick. So I've got the hand sanny on the lanyard because I don't have time to be sick. And kids bring a lot of germs. So I'm really hoping I don't get sick. This is Thursday's outfit. Another big day. Let's go. Good morning guys, it's Friday today. We made it to the end of week three, which is awesome. I am heading off very early this morning because I wanna swing by and pick up coffee for my prac teacher. She bought me coffee last Friday and so I'm returning the favor because it's been a massive week. Yesterday was a really big day with the kids, so yes. That is my plan, but I thought I'd show you my outfit before I go. My top is from Cotton On. My classic Cali pants, I believe. Are these the Cameron pants, I think? My belt is Peter and Jane, and I've got my bays on. And I'm just going to put on my little Cardi. And I've got my sunflower earrings in, which just makes me feel a little bit brighter for the end of the week. And I managed to curl my hair, because I also thought that would make me feel a little bit better. But yeah, I've been waiting all week to wear these. What is in my arm? Oh my god, that's a stick. I'm excited to get my prac teacher a coffee. Hope that makes her feel good for the end of the week. Um, I also, at some point, I want to go to the markets and try and find her some fun earrings because she wears cool, like, drop dangly earrings. Um, or I can try and find some online, but I feel like that would be a really good gift for her before I leave. I love these sunflowers. I'm not sure where they're from some sort of markets but my sister got them for me for my birthday last year but anyway happy friday i hope it is a good end to the week i was gonna do this all as a voiceover but i decided i felt like chatting while i do this so I've just put my serums on, cleansed my face. It is Saturday morning. I was so zonked yesterday, <laughs> which I feel like is an everyday thing on placement at the moment. But anyway, I'm up to my eye cream. I've been using this Bohemian Skin Bright Eyes Cream. I'm really liking it. I'm very pale. Uh, yeah, I had a really slow morning this morning. I was in bed just like, doing things on my phone, prepping some stuff for the podcast and whatnot from bed, which was really nice, before I got up and started doing some lesson planning for Monday, just so that it's done. Um, so all my Monday lessons are like pretty much ready to go. I've just got some printing and laminating to do, but everything's planned out, which is awesome. Um, and so tomorrow, hopefully, I'll just do a little bit of planning for like Tuesday, Wednesday kind of thing. Get my week sorted. Yeah, this week has just been so huge and it was a four day week and next week's five and I feel like that's just gonna feel super duper long. And I'm not prepared for that. But yeah, I was just feeling so tired yesterday. Um, like I could have 100% gone to sleep at like five. I'm not even kidding, I was lying on my bed about to go to sleep so i think i needed a slow morning today i did really want to rush off to the gym but i was like my body just needs to just be 
for a little bit. I'm not going to put my sunscreen on yet. I'm going to let that sit on my face because I'm not going out soon. I did want to show you, I have just started using a new night cream as well. I'm really in my skincare era. This is the one I have been using and I love it so far. I love the CeraVe cleansers. This is not at all sponsored. I bought this. Um, but I restocked of the SA cleanser, which is so good. I use that every night. I love it. Um, and so yeah, I wanted to get one of their like moisturizers. Um, and this one's like quite thick, which I like at night time, especially coming into winter. But yeah, my God, super tired, super sleepy, but it is Saturday morning. I am planning on going to the shops, I think for at least a couple of hours with my mom. I don't want it to be a big day because yeah, placements a lot. So hopefully we can do that in a couple of hours. I think I'm having dinner with my grandma tonight, which will be nice. Um, just a very wholesome, low key, quiet weekend at home, which is what I need. I hadn't planned anything for this weekend just because I purely hadn't thought about it. And now that I haven't, I'm like thanking myself that I just have one weekend where like I don't know I don't have set things like oh I've got to rush off here I've got to rush off there kind of thing that's that's the sitch and my robe from Adair's is like the best thing that I've ever purchased like I couldn't be happier I look humongous in it it is so like big and fluffy but I love that and also look how good my lilies look they are so beautiful I need to change the water but Gosh, they're just stunning and it smells so good in here. Hello friends, it is Saturday afternoon. I went to the shops. Um, I think I remember telling you that. I went to the shops with my mom, literally bought one thing. The shops were so busy and I just, ugh, I can't. Like sensory overload. I really struggle in shops sometimes. Like I have to really be in the mood to be in the shops. And if it's too busy, too crowded, too noisy, I'm over it and it's just yeah like sensory overload like the loud music the harsh lighting like all the people everywhere like brushing against you I just I can't <laughs> I can't out of all of that I only got one thing which I'm a little bit like you know we were there for like three hours and this is all I got really happy with what I did get I got this cute little sweater from TK Maxx love that it is so soft that's why I bought it probably won't be able to see but I thought this would look cute when I go to New Zealand with my black puffer jacket over the top, some boots, that kind of vibe. Um, but yeah, it's a nice, good quality top. Then I came home and had a nap and just rested, really. And I've just gotten onto some computer work and I'm having dinner with my grandma tonight. Don't know whether to go to the gym or not. I, I don't know. I'm in like two minds. Been very good with allowing myself just to rest. And I feel like that is what my body has needed during prac is just to rest and catch up because I wouldn't be able to you know go 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 all the time but also I know it's really good for me and it's one of my favorite things to do is train so I feel like I want to go but I just have so much to do today and I know like some people will watch this and be like that's just excuses but I'm practicing being kind to myself over this four and a half week placement anyway I thought I would open some packages that I got um, on Friday with you guys yesterday. I got a package from Lano Lips, which is like, sorry, what? What? That is crazy. I love Lano Lips, and this is their new lip water collection, which looks stunning. There's like three lip products in here. Oh my gosh. There's three different shades in here. Look, looky at that. It's like lip gloss. Ooh, and it's like minty. Love that. Oh, I'm a big fan. And I love that I don't have to like put my finger on it because Jeremy. So massive thank you to Lano Lips for sending that. I also ordered some ski goggles for my New Zealand trip from Anaconda. They still have the plastic on them. Anti-fog, we love to hear it. These are for New Zealand. Okay, cool. Everything looks really cool colored in these. Wow, they're way comfier than I thought they would be. Can you just see me in this zoom, zoom? I thought these were white. I mean, they kind of look white from far away, but they're definitely blue. And they're orange, the lenses, my favorite. I'd rather have my own, again, Jeremy. <laughs> 
And lastly, this is really what I wanted to share with you guys because... I was really excited um, when this girl reached out to me. She has her own business um, selling prac planners and teacher planners. And I'm so excited. She very kindly reached out to me knowing that I'm on placement at the moment. And this is gonna be so amazing for my final prac in August. First of all, stunning. It's got like the gold detailing and like a hard, linen front gold spiral i love a good spiral book and it's literally just got everything you could need for prac can you guys see the sides oh my gosh so organized lesson observations class information timetables to-do lists yeah lesson obs and then your like daily planner is so lovely like that's just going to be so helpful and a massive to-do list for each day because every day you've just got a million things to do and yeah for all of my assessments with the kids I can like track students and this is just gonna be awesome um, I only have a week left of my current placement so this is gonna be such a gem for my final placement and I just wanted to give them a shout out because I love supporting your own businesses like some of you guys are so talented it just like yeah it makes me really really grateful when I get to like talk to you about stuff that we're both doing and working on and yeah, you guys are so kind to me. I will put where this is from on the screen and down below in case you're also a prac teacher and are looking for a planner. Stunning. But yeah, I'm just not really feeling like driving to the gym and I've just finished editing a vlog. Um, I've got some more editing to do and I also want to record a podcast. And if I don't go today, I definitely will be going to the gym tomorrow. I'm feeling like podcasty, podcasty vibe. Hello everyone and welcome to today's episode of the Intuition Co podcast. 